<laughs> Look at him! Look at Alpha Star! He's just having an existential crisis of being brought back to life! Hey all, bro here. I thought I'd do a little interesting video thing that I've been wanting to do for a while. I want to take a look at some of these plushies and their respective photos on the Pokemon Center website. Because essentially, I was looking up Omastar once, and I noticed his stock image was very hilarious and adorable, and it's just a lot of emotions with it. And I was looking, and I'm like, oh my god, are a lot of these the same? So I thought I'd go down a little road of plushies and discover who looks the weirdest and also the funniest. By the way, these were compiled by Chansey, so thank you, Chansey. Chansey went through the website and found all the photos of- because, okay, essentially, not all of them have photos, which is weird to me, but a lot of them do? So essentially, she just went through and compiled the ones that have photos. So now we're gonna take a look. I think there's like 500 or something. I won't react to like all of them, but probably just the ones that are interesting. All right, we're off we're off to a pretty good start. I don't honestly, okay, it's not that bad. It's just that Venusaur looks very weird. Like Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, and then Venusaur is like, "Oh, but maybe that's just the size difference, I don't know. Honestly, it's rough with Venusaur because a lot of things with Venusaur just look so bootlegged because it's such a cursed design. Like, of the three, which one are you gonna get? Probably not the Venusaur one. Okay, I know I said I would go through the weird ones, and, and I promise not to keep doing this, but the Weedle one actually looks kind of adorable, not gonna lie, that actually looks really cute. <laughs> Rattata's just like, yes, come here. Interesting, Pikachu's kind of going for that, like, Pokemon anniversary thing where the, the head is, like, really round. That's kind of interesting, huh? I mean, I guess this is called like the Sitting Cuties series. I thought they were just Pokemon plushies. But like the coolest thing about this series, by the way, not to get too off subject, is that there's one for every single Pokemon that exists, at least from what I know. So you can pretty much look up any Pokemon on the website and they'll have a plushie for them. And that's really rad. Uh, Vulpix! <laughs> Vulpix with the burning house in the background. Oh my God. Okay, I mean, it's not the burning house. My mind immediately went to that meme with the with the little girl in front of the house they had to be framing it like that look at that <laughs> also I noticed they're sitting plushies but Zubat they kind of used its weird legs to get around that that's actually really weird to just see him sitting on a tree stump like that <laughs> vile plume <laughs> <laughs> Something about Vileplume just sitting there, it's just kind of funny. He doesn't- he doesn't even look like Vileplume. He's just like, hey guys, I'm over here. Paris. <laughs> Paris, oh my god. The mushrooms are so spread out. Oh man, look at Ammonite! It's kind of weird that they mixed in Ammonite, Shelter, Golduck, and Staryu into one image, but I, I guess they were, uh, they were- they had to clock out early that day. Amistar does look funnier in my opinion, but yeah, no, Ammonite- Ammonite still looks pretty funny. It's something really amuses me with the fact that for Alakazam's picture, they just piled some books up and then put <laughs> Alakazam next to him. Yes, I read, how could you tell? Graveler looks weird, I don't even know what's going on with him. He looks like- like a rock, but like not in a not in a sentient way, more like a this is a rock kind of way. Grammar's like ah! Gengar. Okay, yeah, a lot of these photos to me, it kind of looks like they were in one place and they were just like, all right, we just need to throw whoever we can in here. Because even just looking at Krabby, it's kind of the same thing with like trees and stuff. I don't know. Some of them you could tell they didn't really go to an environment specifically for a plush, which. I get it, honestly. Drowsy! Look at Drowsy! <laughs> That's actually a really cute picture. I like that one a lot. He's just kind of, he's going to bed because he's drowsy. Voltorb has just the light bulb over his head. Interesting. Of the bunch, Executor surprising. He he actually looks pretty good, but then again, I guess I can't really make out his other pineapples on it. Wait, no, pineapples, coconuts. What am I they saying here? Mr. Mime, aw. Oh, whoever did the Mr. Mime one had fun with that one. I like that one a lot. Magic Carp, that one's good too. Ew. Okay, we're getting better and better. Oh god. <laughs> I just saw the Gyarados one. <laughs> Why does he look like that? He looks like he has a nose. Jinx. Oh, some of these are just killing me. Look at Jinx. Look at Jinx. The face is so small. You know, it's funny. Of the three, Zapdos looks pretty good. I don't know what is going on with the other two, though. I really don't. This photo makes it look like they have their, like, arms around him. It's like, hey, let's show you what's here, buddy. <laughs> Meanwhile, Chikorita and Totodile are just doing that, like, weird thing where one of them is in distress and the other is like, yes. So, actually, the Johto ones are pretty well done for the most part. Even the plushies look pretty good. But we just need to take a second 
to appreciate Tyrogue standing on a kid's head. <laughs> Just flout standing on him. Jeez. Something about Toga Tick is weirding me out, not gonna lie. Why is his head tilted like that? She looks very strange. Okay, there's two pictures for Zatu, and I love both of them. I love how he's sitting on that tree trunk, just super casually, and then the next picture's just like, huh? I, it just occurred to me, is Bonsley's frown thing just Pseudo Wudo's mouth flipped upside down? Huh. Okay, Sunflora's is pretty clever, not gonna lie. I mean, I would love to see the rest of the body, but that's actually pretty clever. Oh man, so many of these plushies are in existential crisis mode. Just look at Slowking. He does not look okay. He does not. <laughs> and then Giraffe Freak's just in what have I done mode. I know there's like a ton of them like that, but the, the ones of just the Pokemon looking over something and their heads like kind of tilted, those never like fail to make me laugh. I mean, look at Little Fortress there. So cute. Why why is Snubble hanging out with Houndoom and Houndour? That's so interesting. I think they're having a discussion on whether or not fairy type moves are gonna inflict damage on them or not. <laughs> Look at Macargo. I wonder what they burned to get this going. It looks like it's just a little pyre of wood or something, but I have to know. Like they just start burning stuff and they just start pulling out plushies, like, okay, who can we use for the fire here? Okay, side note, but I would buy the crap out of that Smeargle plush. That is an adorable Smeargle plush. Though then again, I'm just a huge Smeargle fan. I also also, I gotta say, I, that might be the only, like, painting of the bunch. So, kudos to them for doing a very unique background for Smeargle. Meal tank and milk. Solid. Alright, so it's a bit hard, because looking at these other ones, they were kind of just thrown onto a desk, so not really all too interesting. But hey, we have Lugia, finally. And Ho-Oh still going, SKA! Though I gotta say, the Pokemon Trainer plushies do make me laugh. I mean, just look at Red here. <laughs> also, whoever had the idea to make a Ditto brand series of it transforming into Pokemon, that's brilliant. And also, also, that needs to be canon in the game, please. Don't tell me it's too hard to make all the models. You literally just have to give them dots. What, what on earth? What on earth? What, what on earth? Zwellis? Zwellis Mitz? What, what is this? I can't believe- that's- that's amazing! How is this a thing? What on earth? That's so amazing! Okay, that Apple tune though, not gonna lie, kinda wish I had one. It also helps that he looks like he's in the same exact environment as the one old guy meme. That literally looks like the same place it was <laughs> taking a picture of. Oh man, you could even hug Apple tune? Come on, man. I like how Ralts had the weird hair. I don't even know if it's his hair, I always thought that was his head but the hair like pulled up from its eyes. It's very interesting. I mean, one, to see its eyes, and then two, to think that they thought like, okay, we have to show them the eyes to show how authentic this Ralts is. Okay, look at Darkrai. Look at Darkrai. I love the little Photoshop tree back there. I can tell because it has like white trimming around it. Oh my God. Anyone who has a Darkrai plush, have it against your window. Oh, but then again, I guess it'd be kind of hard to get those stars. That's, that's like a fake star sky picture right there. Ah, nice work with the evolution having their non-copyright food right there, such as mustard and paper bowl. Ah uh, yes, me, my girlfriend, and her giant arcanine plush. Oh, wait, let me let me pull up a more accurate picture. Ah uh, yes, me, my and a giant arcanine plush. Okay, come on with Lucario here. The, all these photos are amazing. Look at that! Look at that! He stands on his own! He can <laughs> he can help you with the dishes! Oh my god, that's that's actually a really cool plush. Especially because he's actually like to scale. That's Lucario's height. That's so uncanny. I mean, he's made excellently and he has all these photos. <laughs> he's tucking you in. Come on, that's too much. <gasps> oh, look, they have a Detective Pikachu line. Oh my god. Look at Ludicolo. Look at him. Look at crying Pikachu. <laughs> look at Psyduck. Oh my god. Okay, now we're reaching the realm of cursed stuff. What is this? Rowlet, Togedemaru, and Oddish, but they're very squishy? Huh. Okay, not gonna lie, Sandy Gast is, uh, that's a pretty good one right there. <gasps> Look at Wooloo! Look at Wooloo! Oh man, that's probably one of the best pictures I've seen so far. Oh my gosh, look at that! I am Wooloo! I appreciate the Swablu just resting on the shoulder. That's that's really adorable. Bannet sleeping. Interesting. I, huh. I mean, it's adorable. I just thought there'd be something a little bit more creative with Bannet of all Pokemon. I don't know if it's like the angle, but it, doesn't it look like Huntail is one of the old men from the Muppets? Like, I could easily just see him moving his mouth like that. Okay, not gonna lie. Latio, 
<laughs> Latios and Latios make me laugh. I like how to get an environment for their picture. They just held them up and went sky. <gasps> oh, I've seen this one before, Deoxys. Oh my god. <laughs> I love them. I love them. They remind me of the meme where they're like sitting there. Like the four guys sitting there watching something. Oh man, I please use this for stuff, please. Not gonna lie, that Chikorita puppet looks a little weird for certain reasons. But I think the main thing is that like Chikorita as a as a puppet? That's kind of a weird one. Doesn't really seem to lend itself much to puppetry. Okay, I, I like the uh the Greninja Charizard Lapras one just because Greninja just looks so casual right there. Just having a casual day. <gasps> I'll crammy with the coffee mugs. Ooh, everyone's so casual. I guess this is like the Japanese plush side, I think. Oh man, that's a good looking Leafeon. Oh man, that's a good looking Leafeon. I usually always see Leafeon plushies, but I never like any of them, so I never get any of them. Okay, they're having fun. I love the little Gengar line they have going. Oh man, Gengar like resting right there while you do your taxes. That's amazing. There's more casual Greninja. Casual Greninja is a total mood. Okay, that is so clever. Just you crushing score bunny with your arm. Oh my god, I love that actually. That's so clever. Okay, another puppet one, but this time for Shaman. Don't, you gotta do bipedal animals, man. Okay, I love this woman. And I love that plush. That slack off picture is just amazing. <laughs> I love how the other Wulu picture was taken with like such framing and magnificence. But the Japanese Wulu plushies were just thrown into a pile and it's just like, woo. That Tyranitar is chunky. Look at that. Look at that. Whoever took the Metapod pictures, I love this guy. Oh my god. Look at him. He's just playing his Switch in the Metapod. W wait, what is this thing? It's like a be It's like a sleeping bag? Oh, it's like a weird chair sleeping bag thing. Oh my god. I love how one picture is just straight up him looking at the camera awkwardly. Question of the day. What is your favorite picture on the Pokemon Center website? Special thanks to my top tier patrons, Chansey, Terror XD, and Liddy Kitty.